Hello guys, good evening, good afternoon, good morning, wherever you are watching me. It's not a good one for Nigeria football. The display by the Super Eagles of Nigeria against Benin Republic today was disappointing. Very, very outrageous display. This is the worst Super Eagles team display I've ever imagined. Anyway, before I get you into details of the match between Nigeria uh, and Benin Republic in the 2026 World Cup qualifier, I'd like to say thank you for coming. I appreciate the love and support you are always giving on this channel. I sincerely thank you guys. Thank you very much. If you are here for the first time, please subscribe to this channel. Press notification bell so that you don't miss out any of my videos. To all my friends out there, I say thank you. My subscribers, the new and the 21, thank you so much. Please watch the video to the end, give me a thumbs up and share it. 2026 World Cup qualifier, the fall of Super Eagles, Benin Republic 2, Nigeria 1. The loss means Nigerian Super Eagles remain without a victory in four matches in the qualifying series after drawing their first three games. The Super Eagles are in trouble, in a very troubled water now. In the 2026 World Cup qualifiers, after they lost 2 1 to Roy Coach Chetas of Benin Republic this evening in Abidjan. For the second match running, the Super Eagles went into the second half trailing. The Eagles did not start brightly, but they took the lead through Ravel Onyedika's first goal for his country. But a mistake by Kavi Bursi allowed Jude Dose to level for Ruas Men. In the third minutes of other time, in the first half, Breast attacker Steve Moro blasted home in the box as the Eagles failed to clear the corner to give them two goals to one lead. Coach Finney the sent on Victor Boniface and Paul Noachu for the ineffective Terem Murphy and Alex Wobi. There was no communication between Ademola Lukman and a better place Unuachu from a Chukwese cross in the 54 minutes. George Finidi then made further changes before the hour. Ibrahim Olawoyi came on for his debut for Samuel Chikwese, while the injured bright Osaka Samuel had to be replaced by another debutant, Ismaila Sodik. A scramble in the beginning box ensued in the 66 minutes, but the Chetas cleared their lines for a corner. The Eagles needed Stanley Wabali to rush off his line in the 69 minute to prevent a goal scoring chance. Boniface and Noachu collided in the 80th minute as the Eagles became more desperate. A great delivery from Ola when you saw Lukman's header loop off a Benin's defender for a corner kick. Lukman had a chance to shoot or square for Noachu. On the dot of 90 minute, but he did neither and had to settle for a corner. Gabonese referee Acho blew the final whistle after five minutes of added time. The Eagles have three points from three throws after four matches, while Benin Republic lead the Group C with seven points. The next set of matches is in March 2025. When the Eagles will travel to Kigali to face Rwanda and then host Zimbabwe. Is there any way out for Nigerian Super Eagles? With the way they are playing, I don't see anything coming out of these boys. They play like pregnant women. No fission, no tactics. Should we blame the coach? Possibly. He has his own part to play in it. 
This is a team that play without direction, visionless and purposeless. Very, very disappointing display by Nigerian national team called the Super Eagles. It's so frustrating, very, very frustrating. Very, very frustrating. No single player out there can be counted. No single player. No single player. It's so unfortunate, but it is what it is. That shows to you that football is rather play on the football pitch, not with mouth. Okay? Not with mouth. Well, the March 2025, before they place the, you know, uh, this, the next set of matches in the qualifiers. Let's see what will happen. But as, as it is now, no way out. No hope. No hope. No hope. What do you think, guys? What should Nigerian football house do? Federation, football federation do? What should they do? What should they do? What advice do you give to the coach? It's not a good start for him as a coach of the national team. I'm talking of within the judge. He needs to find a way out. If not, he can't last in that on that seat as the Super Eagles head coach. Well, that's all I have to share with you at the moment. Be good to yourself, see. And uh, all we know that you can be the best. Thank you very much. If you have not subscribed, one more time I remind you to do that. Okay? And uh, I will see you next or soon in my next video. Thank you very much and bye-bye.